Hi guys, my name is Yuri. Just like our society, the English language is constantly evolving. And so it's fascinating to see all these new words and expressions being used by speakers and being newly added to the dictionaries. So today we'll learn five new words which are gaining popularity in the 21st century. But before I continue, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. How are new words born? There are many ways, such as shortening, whatever, whatevs, borrowing from different languages, such as robot, a word borrowed from the Czech language first used by the author Karel Čapek in his science fiction play R.U.R. In this video, we'll look at words called word blends, which are words created by combining two words with different meanings. For example, breakfast and lunch make brunch. A meal eaten in the late morning that is a combination of breakfast and lunch. I want to lie on the beach and chillax. Chillax is a combination of chill and relax. It's an informal expression which means to become calm and relax. Where is Gonzalo? Just chillax, Yuri. He'll be here soon. Some people simply say chill. My weekend was chill. <laughs> Isabel? Mm. Are you okay? No. I haven't had anything for lunch. I'm hungry. Hangry is a combination of hungry and angry. It means to become angry because you are feeling hungry. Good, you feeling better? Wait, that was my lunch. Now I am hangry. Where is my phone? Ah, here it is. Are you sure you don't suffer from nomophobia? Nomophobia? Nomophobia is a combination of three words. No, mobile phone and phobia. Phobia means a fear of something. So nomophobia means a fear or worry at the idea of being without your mobile phone or unable to use it. Many people who suffer from nomophobia never switch off their mobile phones. <laughs> it's my staycation today! Staycation is a combination of the words stay and vacation. It stands for a holiday that you take at home or near your home rather than traveling to another place. It's easy to have a staycation in a place like this. Upcycling is a combination of the words up and recycling. It stands for the activity of making new furniture and objects out of old or used things or waste material. You can improve and upgrade your old stuff by recycling it so that it looks brand new. Look! Upcycling is a great way to reduce waste. You might find them in the reading and use of English paper and you can also use them in your writing and your speaking exams. How about you? Which words were new for you? And do you know any more new words or expressions? Write us in the comments below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!